Welcome back to the project. Time now to welcome a bloke who's had one hell of a career. Rip, rip, wood chip, turn it into paper. He's as Aussie as Vegemite, the Hills Hoist and Uluru. Yeah, we know about Vegemite's foreign ownership, but no matter how much money Kraft offer him, John Williamson will not be bought. Let me tell you of an interview with an old man emu. Since performing Old Man Emu on New Faces, John has recorded 50 albums, selling over 5 million copies in an incredible 44-year career. He's won three arias, an incredible 25 golden guitars, and he's been inducted into the Aria Hall of Fame. This country, we are so lucky to live here, and we must keep taking care of it. John's played at the Sydney Olympics, the first anniversary of the Bali bombings, and performed at Steve Irwin's public funeral. True blue. Is it me and you? Proof that John and his music capture the Australian spirit more than anyone else. Please welcome John Williamson! Great to have you with us. Very exciting. Uh, the, I you've feel got... very lucky to be here. Oh, Sorry, stop it. No, <laughs> stop it. You're a national treasure. Bloody hell. Settle down. <laughs> um, you are totes amazeballs. That's what you are. <laughs> totes amazeballs. You've got the book. You've also got... This is your 50th album. Yep. It's, it's an incredible achievement. 50 albums. I've got to say, do you ever, like, write a song? I think you've written something like 500 songs. Mm -hmm. oh. Do you ever write a song and think, no, I've already written that? <laughs> 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 yeah, the melodies can come up again sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> but it's amazing how much you can write over 13 notes. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> and the autobiography is called Hey True Blue, which is, you know, like that's when I heard that, I thought, of course, that's that's the name well, of your it's like autobiography. Beck beckoning Aussies to come and have a look at the book. Yeah. Yeah. But was that your was that your choice? Because I imagine a publisher was like, you well, you gotta call it True Blue or Hey True Blue. Do you wanna call it like John Williams Town or something like that? Or yeah. like, you know. <laughs> Ah, oh, no, well, I'm a, I'm a commercial person, you know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> true, true Blue was my calling card, so Hey True Blue was like saying, you know, hey, come and, come and look, read my book, so it worked, yeah. I think. Yeah. Do you think the definition of a, of a True Blue Aussie has changed? You, well, what is a True Blue Aussie now? Uh, well, I, I think a True Blue person is the same all over the world. It's where you get someone you can trust, someone, you know, whose who's word is your bond, you know, you care about your neighbours, care about each other, just generally about good people, you know. Do you, do you think we still live up to that in Australia? Uh, I think, uh, yeah, I think a lot of us do, yeah. But uh, I think we're catching up to the, the rest of the world a bit, though. I mean, I've got, the, the album's called Honest People, and it's about when I, in my little town of Quambertook in Northern Victoria, where you could leave your car door open and everyone was, wanted to be friendly, you know, like, you didn't have to be, it was just natural to be friendly. Still out in the bush, people wave to you when you go past them on the road, you know, and I think that's disappeared a little bit, yeah. I mean, Australia's caught a bit of a bag internationally with, you know, the last year or so, saying the Aussie fair go is dead. Do you, do you subscribe to that, or are we...? Uh, I'm, I'm pretty positive about Aussies, I think, you know. Uh, and I'm, I'm a, a basher with variety, and we, I'm, I'm with a whole lot of people that are just fantastic. There's millionaires, and there are people who run a cake stall to get into the bash. There are a lot of good Aussies out there, yeah. and we raise, you know, every year about two million in New South Wales. So, yeah. is the good old Aussie language dead? We're talking about amaze balls and whatevs and stuff. Is there a word that you used to say that you know you just don't notice people say anymore? Uh, I still think bloody oath is one of the best ones. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine ever releasing a song called Totes Amaze Balls? <laughs> I, you know, I have actually released a song on the, on the new album called Girt by Sea. I thought it's time <laughs> Girt by Sea got put up there instead of being rubbished. <laughs> as a songwriter, it's the best way to say surrounded by sea, yeah, right. you know. It's Girt very efficient, isn't it? It's very efficient. It's three syllables, bang, yeah, so you the know. bloke that wrote that was pretty smart, I well, think. Well, because there was a study the other day that found more people know the song, uh, the words to the song uh, Get Lucky by Daft Punk than they do our Australian national anthem. That's which was very dis Well, Shame it wasn't. It was a Jim Beam survey or something, so I'm not sure that, that you know, it was a cross-section. <laughs> Jack Daniels and Jim Beam are very different products. <laughs> You've performed all around the country. Is there any place you haven't been? In Australia? Yeah. Uh, not many, but, uh, but uh, you know, it's, it's a little bit uncommercial to sing in a town that's got ten people in it. But <laughs> <laughs> what's, the, what's the most emotional performance you've ever, you've ever given? Uh, probably Steve Irwin. But that wasn't a concert, that was just a one-off. Mm. You know, they're the hardest ones, a one-off because you've got no time to warm up or... Mm. But uh, Steve Irwin was very... We had a rehearsal the day before, so I was least ready for the, the tough stuff, you know. Mm. You nailed it too, didn't you? 
You nailed it. Yeah, just. Yeah. <laughs> just. Um, the book, as we mentioned, is called Hey True Blue, and uh, and the album is uh, Honest People. They're, they're both out now. Um, it's great to have you on. Congratulations yeah, on absolutely. 50 albums. Amazing pleasure. achievement. Great story. Thanks for coming on. Thanks, Thanks, Thank you. Thank you. Is it mine?